Hello, my name is Jesse Galvin. I'm the co-founder and managing director of G-Tech Apparel. I am here today to give you an overview of G-Tech's company background and story, patented Thermagrip technology, new innovative product line, and success we have had getting our product worn by some of the world's top athletes as well as our other key target markets. So what is G-Tech? G-Tech is a technology company that specializes in heated clothing. Our products were originally designed to keep professional athletes warm, however it gravitated towards being a multi-use product that could be used in all types of cold weather. A little bit about our story. In the winter of 2013, G-Tech founder Johnny Frizzani was playing in the CFL as a starting wide receiver. During a cold weather football practice, he noticed that players didn't have anything to keep their hands warm, so he started to build a few prototypes. I tested one of the very first hand warmer samples and agreed that it would work well for football players, but immediately thought that it was a no-brainer for cold weather golf. I took the first 500 hand warmers, put them in my vehicle and drove around every golf course in my hometown where I knew a head pro or buyer and was able to sell all 500 units in a day. Selling out was very exciting and we decided to form G-Tech to help keep athletes of all skill levels warm and performing to their highest ability regardless of the weather conditions. Some highlights since our inception. Our products are currently being used by professional athletes all around the world including several players within the NFL, CFL, NBA, MLB, NCAA, PGA Tour and LPGA Tour, and major sporting events such as the 2016 Ryder Cup and next year's 2020 Ryder Cup. Our products were originally designed to keep professional athletes warm, however it gravitated towards being a multi-use product that could be used in all types of cold weather. Not only can it be used for cold weather activities such as hunting, fishing, camping, snowboarding and skiing, or productivity gains in the outdoor workforces, it can also be incredibly beneficial for those who suffer from cold hand syndromes such as rainoids or arthritis. To date, we have sold over 10,000 units globally to over 50 countries. We have sold to more notorious warm weather countries such as Australia, Brazil, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, and Indonesia. We have also sold to almost every state in the U.S. through our e-commerce website, and month on month, two of our highest ordered states in the U.S. are California and Florida. Please remember, cold is relative. G-Tech received notice that the patented application for our Thermagrip hand warming technology had been granted. Our intellectual property versus our competition. In 2016, we spent over six months in Boston where we recruited seven of the top electrical engineers and product engineers from MIT to help us design our now patented technology. To explain our technology simply, G-Tech has the fastest, hottest, and most concentrated heat available in the heated clothing industry. The key is our small heating surface rolled into our patented thermogrip to help concentrate the heat. We use a small and lightweight battery that heats a very concentrated area. We specifically heat the hands because that is the area of the body where heat escapes the most. If you can heat your hands, you can create circulation that actually heats your entire core body temperature. Once we developed our patented Thermagrip technology, we then created our two flagship products. Our first product is a heated hand warmer pouch. For over 50 years, professional football players wore the same standard, non-electrical heated pouch or muff around their waist. This product has not evolved. There was zero innovation until now. As demand and acceptance for the hand warmer pouch grew, the G-Tech product development team embedded its patented Thermagrip technology into the front pouch of a hoodie to create a more product for everyday use. This revolutionary design of the G-Tech hoodie allows the company to penetrate into the mass market. To speak to the market, through five years in business, we have identified G-Tech's five key target markets. However, there are hundreds of other application and markets that will be addressed as the company's resources grow. The first major market is sports athletes. That covers youth, amateur, and professional. First up is football. Football is where we got our start. We have had players from every team in the CFL and over half the teams in the NFL wear and use our heated hand warmer pouches. This includes players on the Carolina Panthers, Chicago Bears, Denver Broncos, Detroit Lions, Green Bay Packers, Oakland Raiders, Pittsburgh Steelers, Minnesota Vikings, and New York Giants, just to name a few. We are now starting to work with several NCAA football teams, including Kentucky, UC Davis, and Washington State. 
Thomas Arguello, director of equipment at UC Davis, who said, in quote, first time using the G-Tech product, our players loved it. No other hand warmer on the market can get this warm with a simple push of a button. It's a great product, instant heat, and great battery life. I highly recommend the product for cold weather football conditions. There are over 1.5 million football players that comprise of high school, NCAA, and professional in the U.S. alone. Golf. To date, we have outfitted both Team USA and Team Europe at the 2016 Ryder Cup and have already confirmed we will be the official hand warmer provider for Team USA at the 2020 Ryder Cup, and we are in final discussions with Team Europe for the event as well. We also won top new product at the 2016 PGA show in Orlando, selected by Charlie Reimer from the Golf Channel. Yeah. Stick your hands in there. Oh Go ahead. Goodness, Come on. LT, stick hammer. your hand in there. It's nice and toasty, oh, isn't it? I can feel Cam it. Cam Newton oh, has that's been that's using this all year. Lydia Ko, number one there? ranked player in the Seriously? world, it's has really been warm. using this. At the 2019 Genesis Open, G-Tech hand-delivered hand warmers to over 30 of the top 100 players in the world with tremendous positive feedback. The next day, over half of the players that accepted hand warmers were wearing and using them during warm-up and their round. This included Dustin Johnson, Justin Thomas, Bryson DeChambeau, and Rory McIlroy, all four of the top six players in the world. There are over 60 million recreational golfers worldwide. Baseball. We have just received verbal confirmation of our first official MLB team order with the San Francisco Giants. Based on the feedback we got from the San Francisco Giants equipment trainer, there should be no reason why every team doesn't have several G-Tech hand warmers in both the bullpen and dugouts to keep the players warm and allow them to perform to their highest ability. Roughly 65 million players worldwide in 140 countries. Soccer. We have several samples going out to MLS and European soccer teams, including FC Barcelona. Soccer internationally is by far the world's largest sport with 265 million people playing competitively worldwide. Feedback from many well-respected agents, sport industry executives, and professional athletes believe that single-handedly, exposure in the worldwide soccer market would be, in quote, game-changing for GTEC. As you can appreciate, the number of fans is infinitely larger than the players on the field. Every major sports organization's ultimate goal is to enhance the fan experience. The worldwide fan numbers for each sport is football over 300 million fans, golf 450 million fans, baseball 500 million fans, soccer 4 billion fans. Our next big market is the medical market. There is a cold hand disease called Raynoids that causes an interruption of blood flow to the fingers and toes. Typically, the affected area turns white and is usually very painful. For example, one specific customer explained that she was unable to watch her children's soccer games outside or be able to go to the grocery store without her suffering from a Raynoids attack. Our product changed all of that for her. Lynn Wonderman, who's the chairman of the Raynoids Association, said, in quote, We've tested different types of muff products in the past, and most are adequate at providing a certain level of comfort, but nothing compares to the speedy heat and grab-on warmth of the G-Tech product. The G-Tech product works great for other medical conditions such as scleroderma, arthritis, diabetes, and during cancer treatments. Our next market is your outdoor enthusiast. From hunting and fishing, to hiking and climbing, skiing or snowboarding, our heating technology has allowed outdoor enthusiasts to extend their season and continue to enjoy the outdoors in a comfortable way. Yes, I guarantee you, Don already sold one of these to Jimmy Hunt. Beats that. It does. No more. <laughs> they don't have no to. More shaky no more hand shaking warmers. them up and putting them in your pocket. It's Uncle Catfish here. Go get you one of these hand warmers. No gloves. No shaky hand warmers anymore. February goose hunting out here it gets real darn cold, and I tell you what. I'll never hunt without it again. The outdoor recreation industry accounts for over $412 billion in economic activity in the U.S. alone. Military and government. We have partnered with a very compliant U.S. military grade manufacturer named Tactical Taylor. They have currently landed sample orders for us with NASA and the Secret Service, and we are working with them to land a multi-year contract with the U.S. military. The global military spend in 2015 was over 1.68 trillion, with the U.S. spending over 600 billion on military hardware and personnel alone. Outdoor workforces. 
The outdoor workforce was traditionally plagued with the inability to keep hands warm due to the need to operate technical equipment without the impediment of gloves. Our G-Tech hand warmer and heated hoodie have now enabled these employees to increase both their productivity and safety, as well as comfort in the workplace. This has led to an increase in retention and cost savings for numerous employers and industries. One of the quotes from a superintendent at PCL Construction said, I've really enjoyed testing the hand warmer over the past couple weeks. I'm finding it really practical for eliminating the use of heavy gloves. It allows me to keep dexterity when referring to prints on my iPad and hard copies. To speak a little bit to our team. Again, my name is Jesse Galvin. I'm a co-founder, managing director, and COO of G-Tech Apparel. I graduated on the Dean's List with two business degrees from the University of San Francisco. The majority of my role is that I oversee the company's business operations, including sales, strategy development, accounting, legal, manufacturing, and employees and contractors. We also have Clark Jones, who's a director. Clark majored in mathematics and minored in economics from Vanderbilt University. Clark is a sports marketing executive who designs and executes cutting edge strategies that deepen relationships, provide client centric services, and deliver value to all stakeholders. We have Kurt Seust, director. He holds a Bachelor of Commerce, majoring in finance and economics, and is a chartered financial analyst. His entrepreneurial business background, significant investment and capital raising activities in small cap entities allows him to understand the crucial issues and challenges in a fast paced growth company like GTech. Parker Evans, Executive Vice President of Business Development. Parker completed his Bachelor of Business degree at Mount Royal University. Rick Pingle, Global Supply Chain Advisor. Rick is a pragmatic logistics executive who offers over two decades of carrier success across supply chain, logistics, distribution, and procurement operations. Jacob Hoffner, Corporate Counsel. Jake holds a Bachelor of Laws degree from the University of Alberta and is a partner in the Corporate, Finance, and Securities Group of Burnett, Duckworth, and Palmer. Tony Messer, Business Advisor. Tony is the President and CEO of Caliber Planning. Prior to joining Caliber, Tony worked for the City of Calgary, serving in a variety of roles and retiring as Coordinator of Disaster Services. Tony received his MBA from UMBC and has been involved with several startup companies as an owner and advisor. For any additional questions or requests for information, please contact myself, Jesse, or Court Seust. Thank you in advance for your time and consideration.